We will compute the determinant of the matrix shown here using cofactor expansion first along row 2 and then along column 3. To expand along row 2, we go across the elements in row 2 with one term per element. And the first term is minus 1 to the row index plus the column index of the first element times the element itself times the determinant of the submatrix form from deleting row 2 and column 1. The second term is minus 1 to the row index plus the column index of the second element times the element itself times the determinant of the matrix form from deleting row 2 and column 2. And since the third element in row 2 is 0, the third term is 0, so we are not going to write anything. Now we are going to expand these 2 by 2 determinants. The first term will give us minus 1 times the determinant is 1 minus 0 plus 2 times the determinant is minus i minus 0. And simplifying this gives us minus 1 minus 2i as the determinant. We now expand the determinant along column 3. Notice that in the third column, only the third element is non-zero. So we have one non-zero term, and it's given by minus 1 to 3 plus 3 times the element itself times the determinant of the matrix with row 3 and column 3 removed. And the result is simply the 2 by 2 determinant, which is minus i times 2 minus 1 times 1. And that's minus 2i minus 1. And that's precisely what we had before.